Hey guys, so here we are with my first hourly plan with me. Thanks for tuning in. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to go because I've never planned in an hourly before, but I thought I'd just switch the camera on and see what happens. So um, I've been having a look at the decorating sheets again that Erin Condren do. I've used these in the past, but not for a while. Um, so I've gone ahead and cut out a few things um, to stick in. So first of all, I've used this design and cut them into strips. They're all marked out on the back if you want to like measure them and figure out where to put them. Um, but I'm going to use these to start off with to cover up um, six o'clock in the morning. I do work different shifts, but thankfully um, I'm not gonna be starting ever at six o'clock in the morning. So I should cover that up and also add a bit of color to it. Um, I mean, this is the colorful hourly life planner for 2017. Um, so although it's colorful rather than the neutral, it's still not majorly colorful. So I think it's nice just to add in a little bit of extra color where you can so i'm going to stick those in there and then i'm going to use some washi at the bottom and i really like this washi which is like it's by um dove coat i believe they're called and it's like a really fun summery ice lolly kind of washi and it's sort of the same sorts of colors so i thought i would add this in here at the bottom I'll also be doing um, an, a plan with me in my horizontal this week as well. I plan to film that and um, get that up pretty soon. So let's do a side. I have to just turn this around a little bit to make it possible to stick in. Where's the scissors? There they are. Okay. Straighten all this up a little later. But that's where we are to start. I have to fold that around a little bit. Not easy to get these things straight on camera at all. <laughs> anyway. Um, and then what I've done is I've used this one. Um, and I've cut out some strips to represent work um, and to mark my shifts out. And then I've got some of these labels here that are from Erin Condren that I had printing from their website where you can have personalised ones made. Um, and what I'm going to do is I've cut them because if I don't cut them, they'll cover up the times and I don't want them to cover up the times. So I want to kind of stick that in like that. And then let me make sure I've got the right one here. Yep, I have. Um, I'm going to then stick that in here to represent the times that I'll be at work on that day. So. There we go. Again. There we go. There we go. Um, so then I'm going to, I'm working the next day as well. So I'm going to get another sticker there, peel that off, and then I will cut off the last, um, cut that there, just cut that a little bit off. Um, like I said, a full sticker would just cover up the times, and I'm trying not to cover up the times. So stick them there like this. Um, and again, I've cut another strip of washi. Um, it's not washi, it's, it's designer sticker sheets by Erin Condren. <laughs> um, I'll put all the information below as to what was used in this video. Um, I really think that these designer sticker sheets are a really good buy. I've said this before, um, I've had a look at the designer sticker sheets before in a video on my channel, um, and I've also bought the, the most recent ones. I'm not 100% sure which um, kit of sheets these are but they're all still available on their channel on the channel on their website even sorry i'm going crazy today so like i said if you were to stick the label on it it would in full it would just 
go over the time and I'm really trying to avoid that. So I'm just going to carry on on here and mark these shifts out here. But yeah, that's what I was saying. So the designer sticker sheets are, I'd like to say about $13 for a, like a book of them. And you get two of each design in the book, um, 12 designs in each one. So they're, they're really a good buy. Um, they're a decent And as usual, I have um, a coupon code underneath the video should you want um, to apply to get the $10 off your first order. Um, oh, and in case anybody is interested, um, I buy everything that I show on my channel. I don't get anything free as such. The only time I've ever got a discount or anything like that is um, from if somebody uses my link, they get $10 off their first order and I get a ton, $10 credit for the Erin Condren website. Um, and if anybody's interested, that has only, I've only had two credits in the whole time I've been doing this channel. So it isn't something, I certainly don't make any money off doing the channel, but I just do it because I enjoy it. And it's just nice to kind of have a play with everything and think people are kind of watching it. It's, it's nice, you know? But of course, if more people did use my link, then I'd have um, more things I could show everybody, I guess. But, ah well, either way, what's more important is just knowing that people are watching. So if you want to hit subscribe, if you want to like the videos, then I would just be really, really pleased with that. Um, so these are those strips again, pre-cut um, to represent these shifts that I'm doing here. And I'll do all the writing at the end. Okay, so that's the work things all sorted out. Um, and then I've got these that I need to stick in at nine o'clock Tuesday, no, not Tuesday, Wednesday, and at 8.30 on Thursday. Like I said, I will sort those out in just a moment um and then i've got two o'clock on tuesday there and two o'clock on thursday and two o'clock on friday It gets a bit more complicated when um, you've got something else stuck there and it's all together, but there we go, that's the way it is. Um, and then I've got an appointment on Thursday at 6.40. I'll stick that around about there. And then what else have I got to stick in? Let me see. Okay, so... Counting down to the Disneyland Paris holiday. No, I'm going to use them for the other planner. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. So I'm going to start writing um, in here. So I'm going to use this pen to write in my work hours, which are seven until three, seven until three. One until nine, one until no, two until ten, two until ten. Okay, so that is a Sharpie Ultra Fine point marker um, that I find really handy to write on the stickers. As you can see, it does write on the stickers okay. Um, and then right in here in this colour. And it's going to be It's kind of hard to work out exactly what's going to be going on when, but um, I don't know. I guess we try as best as we can in these things.
Now what I'm going to do with these is I'm going to use the multicolored Erin Condren washi tape here for um, this here. I guess it's just going to be kind of trial and error to work out um, what works out best for me in this really. So weird, I'm so used to the vertical and the horizontal, this just feels so weird. So. I do like the idea of this like marking off times if I could just do it in the right way. I mean, I do find once I've done the plan with me, that there ends up being other little bits and pieces that later need to be added. So if you want to check out my Instagram um, information below the video, then you will see kind of like the end product if it does get messed about with at all by me. <laughs> if I end up adding anything else on there, so. Okay. Let's say one o'clock is right when it hits the line there. And then I've got this, which represents a completely different activity. And for that, I'm going to use this washi tape, which is okay. Gosh, I've got things coming off everywhere here. What am I doing? So each of these dots represent a different member of the family, so this probably makes a bit more sense to me than anybody else. <laughs> I guess that's the way it should be, whether it be my planner or not. Um, I'm also going to put in here when I will probably film like a plan with me round about there. So I'll just put that on there. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, and I've got some like little decorating kind of stickers here from Oh Hello Stationery Co. So I'm just going to use some of little stars, just kind of dot them about a little bit. I feel like it just needs a little bit of a uh, of extra something at the moment. Yeah. See, I don't really feel like I need to put in any additional um, boxes for um, writing lists and things. So I've got this whole bar here. So I'm a little bit thinking, I just, I don't really need to do that. Um, I'm feeling like I could add something else. What else could I have? I'm going to use one of these stickers out of the gorgeous new Erin Condren sticker book just to kind of stick over here on the thankful thought box. I don't always um, find it easy to think of anything to write in there so I'll just stick that on there. It just gives it like that interesting little quote which I quite like. Try and line that up. There we go. Yeah I like that. 
So, um, and the other thing I was going to do is I was going to put lunch in, which these stickers are from Paper Chase. So, just put a little strawberry and pineapple, I think. No, it's too big. Just something to kind of mark lunch. Well, maybe Mr. Pineapple will be happy around about here. No, um, so indecisive today. It's all grapes. Yeah, so that is um, the end of this week's plan with me. I'm sorry it's dragged on so long. Um, I mean, I can speed these videos up. It all depends what people want to see. But this is um, my week as planned out right now. Thank you so much for watching. Um, and stick around if you want to see some more plan with me. Thanks, guys. Bye.